Hey everyone, it's Nelson Miller here with PA Creative with another Divi Pro tip. Today I'm going to show you how to place button modules next to each other in the same column. All right, let's get started. Okay, so I have an example here already set up and you can see that I have, you know, some text here and an image and actually, um, by the way, I have like a two thirds and then a one third column. And I would like these buttons to be next to each other, but there's just no way to do that. So if you're watching this on YouTube, you're going to want to click the link in the description down below to go over to the blog. Um, if you're on the blog, you're at the right place. So there's a code snippet that we need. Um, it's very short and quick and easy. I'll show you how to do that. So go over there, find that and copy that and then come on back here to where you're working. Now I'm going to go in here to my page settings and to the advanced tab and just paste some paste that code right in there. Now you could put this in the Divi theme options or you could put it in your child theme um, for, for a more permanent place. I'm just doing it here so you can see it live. So notice that we had this class PA inline buttons. So we need that. So once we have it all here, we need to actually go into the column. Now we're not going in the section or the button module or the row, but actually the column. So to get to the column, you got to click on the row settings. Okay. So go into the row settings. Now this first column here is the one where, you know, it has these items. So let's go in there, go into the advanced tab and here where it says CSS class is where we're going to paste that. And you can see it already worked. So again, this is the column the column CSS class. Okay. So that's where we placed that. And like I said, you can already see that it worked. So, you know, obviously you might not want these to be that close to each other. So you could just go in here and, um, you know, add whatever spacing, you know, you want to add there. All right. Well, I hope this was helpful. Okay, so that's how you place button modules next to each other in the same column. If you found this quick little pro tip helpful, be sure to subscribe. We have lots more coming along with all of our full tutorials. All right, we'll see you guys in the next video.